A labour risk evaluation plan is necessary for every company and it's important to ensure that subcontractors have their own labour risk evaluation plans adapted to your activities. Study in detail the actions you must take during the project execution. Analyse the risks associated with each of those activities and develop a plan in the light of those risks. Here's a quick analysis of the risks in a solar company. It continues on the next slide. For a PV installation on the roof of a building, some of the risks will come from the height. Different types and buildings present different dangers to labourers. PV systems installed at ground level, both fixed and sun tracking systems, can be risky where there are lots of numbers of people involved. They're difficult to supervise and control. And equipment such as cranes also bring their own risks. Here are activities and risks for both roof and ground facilities. There's a greater risk of electrocution when installing at ground level than on roof stop tops because the power being installed is usually greater. Once all the risks have been analysed, a risk analysis of every job associated with each activity should be created. Staff should be trained to be aware of the risks associated with their areas of responsibility and how to respond to them. Distribute protections associated with equipment dangers to every workstation. It's important to designate a person who's in charge of the correct execution of risk prevention plans. And finally, it's very important to develop an emergency evacuation plan.